So we're going to have a quick look at how to add the Google Assistant pages to your Snap Call First vocabulary if you have a version of Snap Call First that you were using before the Google Assistant launch in October 2020. So you'll know if you have or haven't got the pages by going to your dashboard and you're looking for an icon or a button that says Google Assistant. So if that's not there, you will need to get hold of your uh, the new Google Assistant pages. So a couple of things to check first. The first one is you need to make sure that your Snap Call First is logged into the correct MyToby Dynavox account. So go up to the cog in the top corner, then go to User and just check that you're logged in. So in this instance, I'm logged in as john.little at tobydynavox.com. So that's okay this end. Next, I need to go to uh, the internet, and uh, I'm looking for an area of our My Toby Dynavox site called Page Set Central. Now, the quickest way of getting to Page Set Central is just searching it in the internet search tool, and you'll see it's the first item there. You'll see it's part of MyTobyDynavox.com, so the second thing you need to check, and if it's not already done so, you need to make sure that you're signed in on the same My Toby Dynavox account as we've just checked, we're signed in on Snap Core first. So I'm going to search here for Google Assistant. You'll see we've got nine different languages. Scroll down a bit until we get to the UK. Uh, we have a choice of downloading the page set or we can uh, add to my stuff. This is the quickest way because it uses the MyToby Dynavox uh, cloud server to do it. So now I've added it to my stuff and this is available for me to use within Snap because the accounts are linked. So I'm going to go back to Snap. On my dashboard I'm going to uh, use the cog to find an empty button where I want to put the Google Assistant link. Rather than simply clicking on the plus sign here or anywhere in the button, you click in the top corner where the, uh, the sort of triangular shape is and the uh, little chain link is. Click on there and then choose Import Unlinked Page from My Toby Dynavox. It will show you uh, all of the page sets you've got or page bundles you've got at My Toby Dynavox. And this is the one I've just added, which is the Google Assistant page bundle. You can tell by the time that it's just now. So I'll choose Next. It will download that. And then if I'm happy, I choose the top level page that I want to link to. So this one and then import. And now we're into Google Assistant. Um, what you need to do, though, as a final thing, is just make sure you have a Google account and check that you're signed into it. So if I go to user and then down to the bottom there, you'll see I'm not connected to an account. And I would follow the instructions here to log in. I'm going to log in as this one. Allow that permission. You'll see I'm signed in there now. So I can go into here and do things such as... How many people live on the earth? Seven billion. So that's all set up now.